mention that in, a, in an appropriate way. So, you know, with, with Katrina as the context and the background, how would you rate job? Oh, I would say it's been amazing. Um, and another thing is, you know, we've learned from other, you know, Katrina happened before Joplin, so I think everybody learned some lessons um, from from Katrina. And then also, I think the the, um, the, the civilian response was amazing in that, that, so there wasn't really that gap, where we knew that that was something, you know, like, like she's saying, people went into action immediately. Like, you'll, you'll hear stories of St. John's Hospital, where immediately people drove with pickup trucks and transferred patients to the neighboring hospital, Freeman worked on them out in, they had a triage center just out in front on the lawn in Freeman with, you know, no regard for any kind of, um, you know, um, uh, what legal implications that could, you know, people just didn't, it was just, it doesn't matter, let's just get it done. And that's just kind of, and um, I don't want to say it's a difference in the people, but like I said, again, I think that lessons were learned. Um, unfortunately, you know, it's horribly unfortunate that it has happened that way. Um, but I think that a lot of lessons were learned, and also I think right after um, there, there had been a tornado go through here, a similar, very similar, uh, like in F4, I think, um, a couple miles sort of south of here. And so we had already kind of had that co-ad that we mentioned um, in some active organizations where I think we had all kind of been, it was about three years ago, I think. Um, anyway, we would all kind of been shocked into you know, realizing that this is something we have to, we live in Tornado Alley, you know, we need to maybe pay attention to this. And then with, you know, Katrina and all these other, um, you know, when you see all the, the wildfire, it's just all different disasters. I think every time, um, you know, we're humans, we learn from um, our mistakes and hopefully if we're, if we're smart humans, we learn from other people's mistakes. <laughs> um, you know, I, it's just so hard to draw a parallel uh, between the two because they're very, very um, dissimilar situations and um, also, you know, different um, disasters. And I, I know that's the, still the same. It's, um, and again, like she said, this is a place that we've got a history of, you know, this is, this used to be the frontier. I mean, you know, we've, there's a history here. Of, um, we say people got here and said, this is fine in the far enough, <laughs> you know, <laughs> way west or what have you. And um, there's nothing like the Ozarks and Joplin is where kind of the prairie meets the Ozarks. And, you know, people that live here, there's there's more beautiful places on earth and in this country, but we don't necessarily need to see them. We like it here. <laughs> no, and it's not an, um, you know, jingoistic or anything. I mean, we're not trying to, it's not in that way. It's not that we feel like other places are bad, but we just, it's a, this is a wonderful place to live. And even, we are sitting here in the middle of what is really ugly. <laughs> and I'm saying it's, a, you know, it is, and it still is, and it will be, you know, as, as long as I'm, here and probably far in here. And I think this area too has always afforded opportunities for anyone who was willing to uh, work for the community and, and you know do their part and, and work for themselves. It's you know it's a rugged mine uh, you know miners and farmers and, yeah uh, you know rugged rugged people uh, people who endured you know many many hardships. So, you know I know my family came over from England supposedly to escape debtor's prison. Uh, the first person who came and worked the Granby mines and was, was uh, yeah, later killed, you know, in the mines, and uh, you know, by accident. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and so it's, you know, uh, tough, tough people. Yeah, you know, a lot of people have long history. So, who, do you 